Authority forecast. Sponsored by Current Electrical, your Generac Superstore. Welcome back on this Sunday morning, taking a look at the confirmed tornadoes from across the Tennessee Valley on this past Wednesday from those storms that rolled through. We have nine confirmed tornadoes right now across the Tennessee Valley, and we want to show you one of those that touched down across portions of Madison County. This is the Doug Hill McMullen Cove tornado from Wednesday night storms, an EF2 storm. And what they've done here with the Weather Service is they said, oh, we found evidence of a tornado near Doug Hill Road, but we also found evidence of a tornado in McMullen Cove and they've gone back and they've said, oh wait, this was one tornado that went across Doug Hill Road, went across the mountain and went down into McMullen Cove. And so they just combined the two separate tornado tracks into one track and said this is the EF2 with peak winds of 122 miles an hour, a path length of over five miles and a path width of 500 yards wide at its widest point there. So that's just one of the tornadoes. If you want to see any of these tornado tracks, you can visit our website, whnt.com. Today, we're not talking about tornadoes. We're talking about terrific weather instead as we go into Mother's Day. Here's a live look at Florence Harbor. We've got a few clouds working across the sky, but I see blue skies and some sunshine will be coming down here throughout the day today. How about Montesano? We've got some higher level clouds working across the sky, but the sunshine that's not going to stop it from coming down a little bit thicker cloud cover here in Albertville. That's blocking out the sun just temporarily. It'll be peaking on out as we go through the rest of the morning. Radar is clear. Not a lot to talk about here across the Tennessee Valley. Maybe you're planning Mother's Day brunch looking really good through the morning hours. Some sunshine coming our way. Temperatures coming up into the low 70s by 10 o'clock will be in the low to mid 70s by 11 o'clock with plenty of sunshine coming our way. Maybe you want to spend the afternoon on your patio with mom this afternoon and into this evening. We'll see temperatures come up into the low 80s as we head into the late afternoon, early evening hours. Cloud cover is going to start to thicken up though as we head towards 6, 7 o'clock. Temperatures coming down into the upper 70s and another system is coming our way that's going to bring us some rain as we head into the upcoming work week. We'll stop the clock here at 5 30 in the morning on Monday. Showers moving into the Tennessee Valley. Maybe a couple rumbles of thunder as we go through the day on Monday. Tuesday morning, another system coming our way with more showers, more thunderstorms, and here comes a cold front that's going to drive even more showers and thunderstorms as we go Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. So get ready for a wet pattern as we head into the upcoming week over on Sand Mountain. Look at the rain chances going up as we head into the work week. Temperatures topping out in the 70s and 80s. Morning lows starting off in the 60s. The shoals you'll be wet too heading into the upcoming week. More showers and thunderstorms coming our way. Temperatures in the upper 70s, low 80s for daytime highs. Morning lows starting off in the 60s and the Huntsville metro area. You too will want to grab the umbrella heading back to work and school with those temperatures in the 80s. Morning lows starting off in the 60s.